My name is Isil Khan and in this video we'll just learn how can we find the slope of the stair. Let me just draw the stair if I can draw it better. Let's say uh, this is just a single flight stair, right? Having some landing, the steps and the waist, no problem, right? Let's say this is just uh, our required stair, no problem, right? So what does the slope mean, right? Actually the slope over here by the stair means how much uh, angle does the stair waist make with the horizontal line, right? So this is just the simple definition of the slope or the stair, right? But actually the slope is the ratio between the rise and run, right? Or you can say the slope is just the tangent of alpha because tangent of alpha is trigonometric ratio which is just the rise or run, right? So this is just the simple definition of slope, right? So how can we determine the same angle which the stair is making with the horizontal reference line, right? All right, so for this approach, of course, I can use the trigonometric ratio, just like the tangent of alpha or theta, no problem, right? So let me use the same trigonometric ratio over here. And let's suppose if the rise and run of the stair is known, like you can say the rise of the stair is 6 inches and the tread or run is 12 inches. So if it's right, the same thing, then I can use of course the tangent of the angle which is rise or run, right? I can do the plug and chug in for uh, these videos like the rise and run videos, right? Like uh, the rise is just 6 inches and 12 inches represent the run. So the tangent of alpha must be equal to the 6 by 12. And 6 by 12 is just of course 0 0.5. So we can say tangent of alpha equals 0 0.5, right? Now as our requirement is just in alpha, so we can turn of course the tangent to another side of the equation. We can get of course in alpha equals tangent inverse of the same thing, right? Now use your calculator, we can get of course the tangent inverse of 0 0.5 equals 26.565 blah 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 degrees, right? So uh, in alpha, or you can say the slope of the stair is just 26.565 degrees and that's it. This is just our requirements, right? Now what if uh, the rise and run of the stair are unknown? Then of course you can do just a few measurements, right? Let me just draw the stair once again. So you can do of course if you measure uh, a horizontal distance from the two uh, or from the pitch of the stair just like in this palm and one the perpendicular distance up to the west right from the horizontal line just like in this palm right so we can get of course the rise and run then of course we can use the same trigonometric ratio to determine the slope or an angle of the stair right and that's it this is just the basic concept of determining an angle of the stair right and that's it Hey, at the end, if you like my video, make sure you thumbs up and subscribe to motivate me for making more videos, right? Thank you dears for watching. See you next time. Hello, salam.